As was just uh, mentioned, my name is Gary Saltzman, the president of B'nabeth International. And uh, it's nice to be here in front of the group of individuals, not just from the conference, but from the other participants uh, who are here and friends that uh, it's been a little while since I have seen, so it's good to be amongst you all. I am pl very pleased to chair this final closing session of this very significant conference in the presence of over 100 participants in the Conference of Presidents Israel Mission. It gives me great pleasure to do so, both as the international president of B'nai B'rith, one of the two conveners of this conference, along with our partner, the Begin Sadat Center for Strategic Studies at bar -Lan University, and as a member of the Conference of Presidents of major American Jewish organizations. I'm very pleased that the conference accepted our invitation to have this session of our conference also serve as the closing session at its annual Israel mission. Taken together with the conference's historic pre-mission visits to Ankara and Cairo on their way to Israel, this conference is an extremely fitting finale to an exciting two-week period that we all hope will lead to improved relations between Israel and two key countries in the region, Egypt and Turkey, and with all of the peace-seeking countries in the Eastern Mediterranean, including Israel's new strategic partners in the region, Greece and Cyprus. B'nai has long advocated for closer relations between Israel and all peace-seeking countries in the Middle East. We were the first Jewish organization to conduct a mission to Egypt following the signing of the Camp David Accords. And just three weeks ago, we held together with the Conference of Presidents the second Jewish-Greek-American mission to Israel, Cyprus, and Greece together with representatives two, of two leading American Greek organizations. In all three countries, we had the privilege of meeting with the heads of state and with the top political echelons, including Minister Kamenos, who will address us this evening, all as part of B'nai's commitment to build re lasting relationships between the peoples of these pivotal countries and the United States at a time of tremendous turmoil in this region. Coupled with our commitment to the people in the state of Israel that goes back to the founding of the first B'nai B'rith Lodge in pre-state Israel in 1888, B'nai B'rith intends to stay fully engaged in this process as we help advocate in Washington, Brussels, and elsewhere for the support of, the, of these bastions of stability and democracy, of which there are far too few in this region today. We have been so impressed with the success of this conference, even before the concluding session, that we have decided, along with our partners at BESA, to make this an annual event. 